We are not reporters nor journalists. The views, information, or opinions expressed are strictly and solely barber shop talk. We pride ourselves on being uncut, unapologetic, uncompromising, unfiltered, and refuse to conform to anything less than. So if you can't, cut the cap. This ain't the show for you. Yo, who's seen the what last Raisin want? Candy, man? Ah. Oh, I seen that. I seen that during fire. Oh, yeah. I seen, yeah, seen the last those. Raisin Candy. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Killer, you seen I it? Yeah. Did I? <laughs> there was no choking in that episode. Right, yeah. <laughs> I don't even know, but let's talk about it. Ooh. Nah, talk to me, you know what I mean? What y'all <sighs> think about the episode, man? What y'all think about, you know what I mean, so far? How I love it. Yeah, uh, yeah. Who, yeah, I'll, I'll go first if y'all want me to. I, I ain't wanna, you know what I mean. Uh, you wanna talk? I'm trying to see if I see the last man. one. Uh, yo, listen, I ain't go cap. Okay, yo, for I, that's three things I want to break. A couple things. All right, one is yo, I love the dynamic between Rock and uh and, and, and Joey Badass, yeah. which is uh, unique. unique, unique. Yeah, yeah. Unique. I love the dynamic. The fact that Rock knows. Like, yo, this is not, this is not good. Like, Rock is like, yo, I like him, but I, I can't do this. I'm trying to, she want a family back. Even though it is messed up, we will get to that, which she did. But I love that the, 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 I want you my, you my enemy, but you not my enemy no more. I really love you, but I know we can never be together. I love that little dynamic that they have. And I don't think it's going to last, but I love it at the moment. What she did to her son, Kanan, was terrible. Yeah. It was messed up, bro. What she did to everybody. Yes, man. And I feel so oh, bad. No, no, no. What she did to Kanan was extra, though. Yeah, it was bad, bro. It was bad, bro. Kanan trying to move around out here. She put a gun in his book bag, bro. Ain't no. Oh, I didn't see that. Okay. Okay. Yeah. It's good. Oh, dang. My bad. Yeah. Ball alert. Yeah, no, no. I was like, you know, I'm up in Connecticut doing lover boy shit. I should have been watching Kanan. Right, yeah. It's my fault. You know what I'm saying? Check it, man. You know that shit ain't gonna stop that nigga. He's still gonna watch this. I'm definitely gonna watch that shit like I never heard this. Another thing I like, one last thing. (laughs) Another thing I like is I love the dynamic between the brothers right now. We get to see them, them together, smiling with each other, happy, and it all evolves around music. Mm -hmm. I love that. That moment at the bar when he was like, matter of fact, though, it started in the house. When he was like, hey, man, I want you to come down and check out something that I'm doing. And then they went down and he started talking. And he's like, yeah, I'll invest in this place. And I like it. I love that dynamic right there. I love that brother. Like, my brother got my back. He was like, yo, please don't bring none of that. Let me do yeah. this, man. And he was like, I love him. His character is really standing out. What's his name with uh the the brother with the chain? Uh, What's called? I mean, oh. They both got chains. Yeah, I mean, uh, you know, the fade, the fade, the, music, the fade. The- Oh, not the music. Nah, not the music you one. About uh, Dubai's pops. Yeah. Uh, what was his name? Uh, I can't Uncle, remember. Uncle character. some shit. Yeah, yeah. Yo, uh, matter of fact, talking name? about him. Yo, yeah, his yeah. relationship with Jukebox now is fire. Right, he's bro. So supportive of her and trying to be that dad. That yeah. shit is fire. Shouts out to them actually changing that narrative, though. That's fire. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I like yeah. how he switched it up without forcing it. It yeah. just, it, just it, it flowed in with the writing. They they showed like and and how they did Marvin. it was so Marvin. Marvin. How they did it was so fire because it didn't start with just him just wanting to be a father. It started with him fixing himself first. He was going to yeah. the counseling. He had to learn how to talk to people. He started respecting people a little bit more. Then he started to find you know his flaws and he started to respect his daughter more. And now he's supporting her. like that whole shit is. That shit is fire. How they, how they, it is, it is. Marvin really evolved, man. He really, yo, from saving his, uh, one of the guys who he was going to counseling with, Mm -hmm. he saved him. And then in this episode, he's like, yo, man, you know, let's, let's have a little, yo, it was so crazy when he, when, when, in that moment, I was like, yo, that's really cool. Like they having like a, you know, every week they go link up and, you know, therapy with each other. That joint is so crazy, bro. Even the nigga that when he did the hit on the mafia nigga, that was the nigga that he was beefing with in the hallway before he started his counseling, who yeah. was now the driver to help him out. Who that's was also crazy. the nigga who let him in that's when they crazy. were shooting at him. He told yeah, him to come in his door. Yeah. So it's that's like, crazy. yo, that's like crazy. You ne- like that, that just teach you, like, yo, you never know, like, nigga, just say, yo, you never know who to be nice to, man. You never know when you're going to need somebody. 
only thing I'm mad about is I know this is not gonna last. Yeah. It can't. It's not how it's written. Something is going to happen, and it's just going. Yeah, yeah. I can't it. spoil it for y'all, but the, at the ain't no time, way, ain't no way. Yeah, we spoke about this. It's crazy. I got some <laughs> shit coming. Ain't no way, yo. And that Rodney, somebody need to smoke Rodney. Yeah, Rodney, yeah, Rodney. I was just now. looking. At, I was just looking up unique brother. I couldn't think of his name. Yeah, he bugging that nigga on a different type of time. Nah, yeah. you didn't even see the last episode, bro. I he was so mad when he time, killed Dean, bro. bro. Oh, that just had me tight, bro. Because he was he ain't even do nothing to him. He just told him, "I don't rock with the South Side. You in the wrong place." That's all he told him, bro. You, you you can't get no drugs from me, bro. And he smoked him, bro. Yeah, Ronnie been on yeah, right. This dude here, man. Yo, but ain't Different. this the same nigga from? Ain't the same motherfucker from what you call her with the curls? Oh. What's the movie I'm thinking about? Drop about to drop a dime on them niggas. Nah, that's not him. He way taller than him. He looks just talk about, like that nigga. Talk about an old classic, like one yeah. of them paid them folks. Yeah, 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 yeah. He looks nah, just like that him. nigga with the jerry curls in the beginning. You sure that's not him? That's nah, definitely not nah, him, because that dude is, nah, he was short. This dude is like 6'4". <laughs> like, this dude is way taller. Not to mention, that dude was well, that nigga, that shit was well long ago. Yo, you yeah. know who I be thinking about all the, in, when I watch the show, and I be like, yo, because that was about to be an A.O. moment. Yeah, about to say you about to yeah. move. I be like, dang, are they gonna rewrite him back in at some point? Symphony, like, where does he? I know he left, but it would be oh, dope yeah. if if he came back on some other time. Like, I don't know, maybe, maybe he'll come back later on. But I just, you know, I was thinking about that the other day. I was like, man, what's Symphony at? Bro? I'm mad. Uh, Symphony, Symphony, yeah. Symphony never got that. That's the a little pretty boy. That was uh, the boyfriend. You said yeah. that nigga was pretty, bro. What? Yeah. Pretty boy. I didn't say he was pretty. Who was Bro. Symphony though? Symphony was Rock's Rock was uh, boyfriend. boyfriend. Oh, yeah, boyfriend. Yeah, the yeah. dude that there was cool with yeah. with Kane and they tried to show him about the architect that and was all that. Right. Right. Yeah, that's name Symphony. Yeah, that's yeah. Symphony. I always be like, dang. But Symphony held it down though. Symphony, that's what I'm saying. He got part of the business and all. Yeah. But, but uh, yeah, I just had it up. This episode was fire, bro. I ain't gonna lie. I loved every bit of this episode. I watch that shit and I also like how uh, Laverne is coming out. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Like how she's starting yes, to glow so. more and smile more and you just so, starting to get more attached to her. I thought I thought when she went to the shit to join the um like join the army and shit, I thought that was gonna be her transit. So they did it twice. They did it the first time when, when the detective chick started hollering at her. I thought this was gonna be her transition into come, mm-hmm. becoming a cop. Then they pulled mm-hmm. back, and then they did the army shit. And I'm like, okay, this is when she gonna go in. She gonna find herself, come back being a cop. Then they pulled back, and she now doing the music shit. So it's like, when does she go and become this cop that we know she's gonna be later on with Fifth? She doesn't. She doesn't actually turn into a cop till late, um, according to the show. So they, I guess they're just lining it up in a sense. Like she's always had that idea that to try to break away but she I, wasn't a cop long before 50 was grown so it wasn't like she was a cop for 10 15 years i believe when when fifth was with her in the show it wasn't no introduction that she just became a cop it looked like yeah, she, she wasn't a cop she, long though i don't know because in the show she looked like she held shit down she had she had the connect she was a dirty cop which means she must have been in for a long time to get that status she had for fifth to do what he was doing with her so she had to be a cop for a while I mean, I, I definitely think that group is not going to work out. Not such a teenager, though. Yeah, not such a teenager, though. Yeah. I definitely think that group is not going to work out, but it's dope that she actually gets the opportunity to do that. I like how the girl came in and definitely that's how the music industry, you see how she talking to them? That's how the uh, managers used to do back in the day. Like, yo, I own you. Da, 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 all that aggressive. Da, 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 I'm pitting this label together. I like that, too. Like, that was realistic. Or what you know in the nineties, early nineties, or whatever that was, the eighties, whatever you know, that's that's reminiscent of that around that time. And I also like the De La Soul reference, the Tribe Called Quest reference. I like all of that. That was very that was a music episode. I like that. <laughs> well, parts, not a whole music episode, but you know, just parts of it. I cannot find this dude, the Rodney character. 
Yeah, Ronnie need to be shot immediately. Trying to figure out his discography. Word. Yo, bro, and then. Yo, nah, man, if y'all to the chat, nah, man, if y'all haven't seen Power Raising Canaan, nah, man, make sure y'all go check that out. And then Unique came at the end and told him, like, yo, Unique needs just smoking, bro. Because he told him, he said, you ain't, you went to the connect. With, uh, he told me everything. Yeah, smoke him, bro. Get him because he going to do something you going to regret, bro. Yo. I mean, I think that's what it's going to end up having to come down to, though. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. He going to have to. He gonna have to take him off. Yeah, I want to see. He's a problem, bro. This is very important because it looked too like it's getting to a point where he gonna have to pick between him or or Rock. Yeah, mean? yeah. Because you you already see Ronnie, he he shining up to to Lana Brock. Yeah, man, trying to get Rock time. That's crazy. She not even in the game. I don't know why people not believe. She said she out of that joint, bro. Yeah, she say that, but you already know how that go down, man. Remember he didn't bought the plaza. Was- that, yeah, that's what I was gonna say. Remember when she was at the spot, the 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 uh, salon spot? She was already in there applying. Know what I mean, her brain—I I feel like you can see it in her mind. Like, all right, this is like a spot for me to come through, wash wash money and all that. Wow, that's what you got out of that. I ain't gonna lie. I thought she was that's looking at I that. Got. I thought she was looking at that like, yo, this is somewhere I can go legit and give back. Right, that's what I was. That's what I got out of that. She bought the I plaza. Think that's what they trying to take her to, but. Rock is a hustler. You could tell she a born hustler, bro. Like that's in her blood. I I think she wants. That's why even back. Kanan, like nigga, you think she ever leaving that shit behind? She ain't. Ne- he said one, which I ain't gonna lie, nigga. That shit stuck. That shit was fire when he said that. Nigga well, said when she said she leaving the game. He said, nigga, she is the game. Yeah, yeah, that was hard. What? Yeah. That was fire. Yeah. Hmm. You know it's fine. That was definitely that was that was that in a nutshell. Yeah, that was hard. But I, I I definitely think she is trying to lead the game, and that's that's the problem is people don't ain't want believe her. Yeah, they don't want her to leave, bro. She because you could ain't no way she go plant a gun in her son's book bag just to get him yeah. to come home <laughs> where she can be a family and they could be together for her to go back to the streets. And she know that's not what Kane want. But that also Kane showed and- the. the that also showed the demon. The length she would go. Yeah, the demon, the demon ways that she be on. Absolutely, I mean absolutely. to get her way. You feel me? That's yeah. tough that she would do that though. Like that's wild. Cause she didn't even know how that was gonna turn out. Like she just was he like, just you know. know what? Nah, she knew. That's why he looked out the window when he already said, "Yo, a, stop calling me. You gotta do your own thing." He was like, "Yo, stop calling me." He knew it. No, knew no, it. no. But nah. See when he when he looked at see that part though, hop. I don't think he heard. She didn't say anything. She was real slick about that. Like she played it off like she had nothing to do with it. But she called the pops to help him get out. Right. So that's all. That's all. Kanan heard. So it wasn't. It's nothing that looks bad on her part. Like now nah, she would have came out to him and said like, "Yo, she, nah, that's a I, sign, I mean, bro." Nah, yeah. bro. That's why he's looking, bro. Like I know she did something. That was her, bro. Of course, he don't trust Kanan her. Know, bro. Yeah, he, he don't know, trust bro. her at all. Yeah, he don't trust that at all. And his boy, oh, he dirty too, bro. Oh, you famous? Oh, yeah, famous man. What the heck, bro? Why you ain't yeah, telling your man? Had to do it. Yeah, bro. You fuck. That episode where he slapped that nigga famous. That shit was dope funny. I was, he said, yo, that was I dumb said, funny, on, bro. He was on a different said, type of time. Kane, hold on, Kane is yeah, yeah, yeah. He getting on his bully shit. Hold Can on. you see how he walking out the door? He walking with that yeah, bot down down the block and all that, bro. But I ain't gonna lie, you gotta get rid of that accent, bro. Yeah, I don't like the accent, bro. Me, bro. <laughs> that fake 50 accent is the fifth joint, crazy. Yeah, yeah but 50 ain't stopped talking to it like that till you got shot. So, yeah, so you got shot, that's a fact. Yeah, like, how how you talking about it like that he ain't even get shot yet? Yeah, I don't like that. 